Hello everyone, welcome. This is a nod, nod, spoon. Yeah, a big revolution has started in India through the music called Enjoy Enjoy Me. In this, I'm going to explain some of the important lines for the global viewers, and I'm going to talk about why this song is the next step to our music industry in India. Yeah. Let's start with explanation. Starting from this video, that is the music video, we could hear some sounds. First is that uh, frog sound and second is the parrot drumming sound and and the ground is reacting to that sound, the drum sound because of that vibration. That's how, that's how it starts. I would start with the line. <laughs> In this line, what it says is that the biggest tree on the event, the oldest tree in India is the Alamaram. Alamaram means banyan tree. Yeah, banyan tree. In that tree, the bird, the bird, and uh, the mention here is that Vannakili, which is a parrot, lived here in that in that tree than that banyan tree. That's what it means. Nalla padi valachali in the manne kudutane purva kudi. Our ancestors gave this land to us as a blessing. Nalla padi valachali in the manne kudutane purva kudi. To live happily. Our ancestors gave this land to us as a blessing. To give, uh, sorry, to live happy. That's what the line says to us. If you compare both lines, Anna kili, anna kili, adi ala marakila vanna kili, nalla padi, vala chali, in the manne kudutane pova padi. The ala maram, the banyan tree, which has grown from the ground, gave its branches to the birds so that the birds could live happily. Same as our ancestors gave their land to us so that we could live happily there. That's what it means. That's what I think. Yeah. <laughs> This says that our ancestors sang through their life across the river banks and then farming fields. Right, that's what um, it shows that it shows that the songs, rhythms are being inside our blood from our birth. Yeah. And even it shows that our life has started from the river banks and by doing farming. That's what it gives a double meaning. Can I say? Yeah. It gives two meanings. If you think in that way, you get this, that meaning. If you think in this way, you will get this meaning. Yeah. Okay. Next line is Nainari Punekela in the Eri Kulam Kurasundamari. They are saying that even dogs, cats and all animals have the right to right to that lake. That's what they are saying. Which means that even dogs, cats and all animals have the right to drink water from that lake or have the right to live in the land. Not only human beings have the right. Like how we say that Every everyone, everyone is common, like everyone have the right, every human being have the right to drink or live in that place. That's how, that's how, like every creature in the world have the right to live in the world, have the right to drink water, that's, that's what they're saying. I don't know whether many people understood or know the meaning of the main word in Jami. It is the main word of this song. It depends, uh, I would explain that. It would 
depends on the situation of the person who says that. Like for example, I have three examples. First example is that when we split the word enjami into en plus sami, en means my, sam means lord, which used to call the god, my lord. That's how we call the god, right? That's one kind of a meaning. And second is that when a younger person calls his or her parents or grandparents, grandparents, we can use that word in Jami to call them because uh, they are like our Lord. Uh, they were the reason because they were the reason for living here. Without them, we wouldn't have been here in this world. Third is even our parents or grandparents call their children or us as in Jami. It means um, my dear. Like it's like uh, sweetly calling them. That's what that's what it means. Okay, next is Devatani Chokka Minukum Natikara. This is my favorite line. I don't know, and I also don't know whether many of you understood that. I will, I would, I would say the meaning of each line. Devatani Chokka, which means Devatani means uh, spell. Chokka means. Uh, dress i would say what is what that means uh, when when the people work in the field under the hot sun they dress right chokka the dress get wet due to the sweat that is where wet and chokka the dress get wet due to the sweat that's what it means minukum natakara like uh, we would say the farmers are the pillars of our country that's why we call them as a natakara as a countryman, Natakara means countryman. Miniku means uh, shining, blowing up. Like if you come, if you combine those both uh, both lines, Vervatani Chokka, Minukum Natakara. When they work, they get sweat, and when the sunlight falls on them, they glow up like shining, shining. That's what it means. This is my favorite favorite part, the bridge part. Patam Bhutan Kata Bhumi Which means uh, our ancestors Patam Bhutan means ancestors Kata Bhumi Kata means protector Bhumi means uh, our earth that our ancestors protected our earth. That is what Patam Bhutan Kata Bhumi. Our ancestors protected our earth. That is what it means. Next is Atam Bhutu Kata Um I would say Atam means it's like I hope it's like dancing. Uh, Atam Bhutu Kata Bhumi. The Lord our God is dancing. If we if we translate it, it might say this kind of meaning, but I would explain it clearly. Like we have a belief that if some disasters happen, like flood, some kind of disasters happen, uh, then we would think that we have done something wrong or harmful or something bad to the earth. That's why our law or our Lord. The God is dancing on the earth with so much anger. He is dancing on the earth with so much anger. Because of that dance, because of that dance with, with so much anger, the earth has lost its balance. It couldn't uh, bear that dance. It, it couldn't bear that uh, anger. That kind of thing. Yeah. That's what, that's what it means. I hope. If you think that my explanation in this line is wrong, please do, please do say in the comment so that I could learn it. Yeah. Nandan Chutti Vanda Seva Kuluchi. Ratina means, uh, may go wrong. Uh, Chutti Vanda means, um, like, going around, like, circling around. I can say that. Seva Kuluchi, like, um, the crows, right? Um, 
the crow was moving around the world from one place to another in uh, around like like a merry go round that's what uh, that's what it say at the port to which a yacham dane kaada marichu namba naada marichu inda veeda marichu in this line they say that when the crows right or the birds move around the world around the world from one place to another they leave their waste throughout the world throughout the earth because of their waste which which spread the seeds throughout the earth throughout the earth and it became the forest and that became our country and then it became our home that's how that's how our home came that's how we are living now this is what this part meant to me yeah that's why i love this part and at the ending of this part we could hear the veeda marichi we could hear a bass guitar sounds it it sounds like a honey flowing in the in the in the song yeah <laughs> Yeah, I even have a doubt whether you people understood that. Sini Karimbe. Uh, uh, if you have seen that video that uh, and below the caption in the captions, we could only see that sugar cane. I don't know whether many people understood that. Sini Karimbe means sugar cane. It's la it's a sweet like uh, we would call our children or the close ones as my sweetie. my darling my sweetie that's what we call them right that's what it means sugar cane my sugar cane my sweetie <laughs> like my sweetie that's what it means that's how our parents or grandparents call their children sini kadumbe that's what it means okay i hope you understood this understood the explanation now we will get to the second part of my video yeah why the song is the next step to our music industry in india or south india i have if you have seen my video previous video i have complained in my previous video that many artists are not making songs based on real life nature mental health like we always had a we always had a, most of the songs based on the concept of love break up and some kind of same 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 repeated emotional songs yeah but if any new people or see this song they would think that this song is out of the box to indians it, it is out of the box to many indians yeah that's what i think because we never explored more or accepted this kind of this kind of uh songs of the artists right i can't say that we don't accept it i would say we never explore or we never had the knowledge globally that's what i could say i am happy for this song and i am also thank you so much i i have been following like her like one year right i think he has had um, had this plan many years before that I I could I could see his vision like I was I was having some doubts like whether he would give some a big 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 bumper bumper in this Tamil industry or the Indian music industry like I had some doubts like he was giving many tries and many things he was trying out to figure out uh, how he could. Uh, take our music uh, and take our individual musicians artists idols uh, to global level that's that's what i think i have noticed him yeah this is the ari jo and in santos narayan sir and the whole 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 visual team who said that through this mv that not only the music right music is so man it is so important music is so important that even uh, what i think what they try to say is that uh, even the mv creation is also important for making this kind this kind of 
creation. That's what I would say. Yeah. It's something need to be reached globally or reach uh, need to reach many people. This kind of creation is needed. I would say very well level. Yeah. And and if if artists like can I mention them? It's okay. I would mention their names. And if artists like Tony Kakar or Bacha or Yao Yao Hoi Sayer, if those kind of artists see this video, please, please, please change your mindset. I would say that. I hope you people change your mindset or your musical style. Give some meaning to the songs, man. Come on, we need to change. Like, stop doing shitty songs and stop appreciating the people or the musicians or the artists who does this kind of shitty songs. Like Tony Kakar, Bacha, your horny singer. Like do songs, music with some meaning, so that it could reach many people, so that it could uh, be in their heart for many years. Even if you have a less views, it could give them something meaningful. It could give something meaningful through our music. That that's what I think. Music can do many things. It can say many things. It can change a person's life. And language doesn't even matter it is not even a barrier to music if it has a good meaning that's what i say i hope this doesn't stop and this need to be reached more to the people so that the people could understand this please to share this song please share my video too if you liked it i think this is the biggest step in our Indian music industry. It needs to be not even not. I I don't want to uh, put a barrier within that Indian music industry. I would say India or even yeah. I would say India, Indian industry. It it needs to be reached globally. Our music needs to be reached globally. Our artists should be need to be reached globally, and it will make a big history. That's what I hope. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you understood my explanation. If you know, and I would even say that if you think that better, I did some wrong explanation. Please do comment. Please do comment down so that it would help them. I would. It would help me also. I hope your day ends happily. And this is Sujita Matini. Bye.